In this video we will get familiar with probably two of the most important commands which every Stata users use a few times every day, which is summarize and table, right, when you get started with your data. In the previous videos we looked at how to uh, load the data, so please check our channel for more details, so we loaded it. And uh, summarize, it's super powerful comment because it gives you a lot of information about your, da your data. So we just highlight this line and click on this execute selection. And you can see here that for each of the variables included, right, so it's a data on houses sold in Ames, Iowa. I just selected 10 uh, features, 10 characteristics. Uh, you can see that it runs from sale price to year sold, like some of the variables. And for each variable, summarize comment reported the number of observations, the mean value, standard deviation, minimum and maximum, right? So when you start working with a new data set, that's what you want to learn first uh, in order to understand the scale of the variables. And, you know, if there are any missing observations, if there is something is missing, you have less observations here, right? And sometimes if you want to build a model and you have like, I don't know, 3000 observations, but for some variables, it's only like maybe 300, you have to do something about that. You can replace it or drop it, but of course uh, you cannot put it in a model. And the second super powerful comment, of course, it's a tabulate. So for example, uh, there is a variable called number of full bus. So if I highlight the line 25 uh, tabulate full bus and click on execute selection, you will see that for discrete variables, right? Of course, you cannot tabulate a continuous variable like a sale price, right? You... So if you use tabulate command for a variable with many values, like sale price, you will not get the error sometimes, sometimes you will, if there are too many of them, but it will not be very informative. So for example, if I type tabulate uh, and sale price, uh, you see that uh, a lot of houses are unique in terms of the price. Maybe some of them have, you know, they're like maybe, I don't know, four houses which are sold for $257,000. But in principle, uh, you can't really get much from that table because houses run from under 13,000 to a very high price, right? So again, tabulate works best when you have just a few values, in, like a discrete kind of uh, type of the variable. And also notice that both for summarize and tabulate, you can use a short names like SU for summarize, right? And many commands in Stata will work fine uh, if you just use the short names, you have to learn them. Uh, or again, likewise for tabulate, instead of uh, typing this whole name tabulate, you just type TA, right? And you get the answer here the same as before. Uh, of course, again, if you become more experienced, you will learn these short names and you'll never use the long names again. And uh, like here's an example when you can actually get the error message. So I want to uh, plot uh, cross tabulation. It's another powerful technique here that we use. So I want to cross tabulate the number of fools bus versus sale price. And I get the error message. There are too many values. And again, it's common. Uh, don't be surprised. You just don't need to use uh, this particular type uh, of command. However, there are examples when you can and you should use these tabulate command. For example, for cross tabulation, when the number of values in each variable is not very high. So for example, I use again a short name TA. Uh, I highlight these two variables. I want to cross tabulate the number of full bus versus the overall condition. So if I click on this execute selection, it gives me quite long table, right? Because overall condition runs from one to a nine and the full bus number of full bus runs from zero to four. And you can see that majority of houses have one to two full bus and also have condition five to six, right? So again, it's very informative and very convenient. Thank you so much and talk to you in the following videos. Thank you for watching this video. If you want to jumpstart your Stata journey in 2023, please check out the coupon code in the description to the video. Bye-bye.